Dear Sheikh Rashid bin Hamid Al Naimi, President of the UAE Football Association, dear friends and colleagues, it's my real privilege to join you today, although it's a long way from our normal gatherings. These have been uncertain and unprecedented times, not only in the history of our great game, but also in the modern world. We've seen the world close down, and our game, the football, which brings joy and excitement to billions across the globe, has also been suspended. Health, well-being and safety of our all stakeholders was and remains our priority. Now that we've seen the first glimpse of light as our teams return to training and many leagues plan to restart, so the timing of this event is perfect. And so the title, COVID-19 and football, on how the shape of the future has changed. I congratulate the United Arab Emirates uh, Football Association in partnership with UAE Pro League and the International Sports Convention on this initiative, and that we gather today via video link rather than meeting in person is a clear indication that the world has changed and changed dramatically. More and more we see that such conference and even the FIFA and AFC meetings and Congress will become online event like this. It's an excellent initiative by the UAEFA who under their new leadership have shown themselves to be at the forefront of innovation. Clearly this will not be the only change. Seasons have been canceled despite executive and determined attempts to play the games. In other cases, seasons have been shortened or delayed, but in almost every one of these examples, the matches that will be played will do so without spectators. We all agree that this cannot be the new normal, but a transition back to a time when our game can be played safely with crowds present. The interaction between the player and the action of the fan is one of the defining elements of our sports. So we must look to maintain that relationship as much as possible when it's safe to do so. Throughout this pandemic, we have worked with all our member associations and leagues and clubs and the confidence that the competitions such as the AFC Champion League and the Asian national team qualifiers can return. It is another demonstration of the AFC unity and determination to assist its member association to prosper and for their teams to take part in top level competitions. The world will change, but change can be positive throughout solidarity and unity, and inshallah, we will rise together stronger. I wish you all a great conference, a productive outcomes, but most of all, stay safe and a successful return to the field. Thank you so much.